to show you how you can easily generate purchase orders from sales orders in Dynamics 365 Business Central. So what I'm going to do is create a sales order, put an item on there that I do not have an inventory at the time. I'll generate a purchase order, receive that, and I also want to reserve that to make sure that when those items come into my warehouse, they're reserved for the specific order. So here's my order here. I've already entered it. It's for this Paris guest chair. You can see from the notification at the top that I do not have enough inventory for this. So what I can do is just generate a purchase order from this order. So let's do that. And what I can do in the sales order is I can reserve the quantity that I'm going to receive in from the purchase order for this particular order. So let's do that. I'll go to line functions and reserve. It'll create this reservation in the system, which will link the purchase order to the sales order. So let's go ahead and do that. So what I want to do is go to Actions, go to Functions here, create the purchase document, and then create a purchase order. Let's do that. This page is showing me what it's going to create the purchase order for. I can change the quantities here if I wanted to. So here's my purchase order that was created from the sales order. I'm just going to go ahead and post that. If I go back to the sales order, I can see that I now have enough inventory for this. I'm not getting the message above. I can then go ahead and process this order. So let's go ahead and do that. I'll just post it and off it goes. So in this demonstration, I showed you how easy it is to create purchase orders from sales orders in Dynamics 365 Business Central and how you can also reserve that quantity coming in against specific orders if you want to.